Greetings to everyone! Today I will show you how to expand polynomials using special products. In this video, we are focused on getting the special product of a sum of a squared binomial. And the process is we multiply binomials using distributive property and the duplication depends on the exponent of the binomial. Find the expanded form of a plus b raised to the power of 2. Since the given binomial has the exponent of 2, you have to multiply the binomial by itself twice. Now we have a plus b times a plus b. The first process that we need to do is to multiply the first terms, which is a times a is equal to a squared. And then multiply the outer terms, which is a times b is equal to positive ab. Multiply the inner terms, which is b times a is equal to positive ab. And multiply the last terms, which is b times b is equal to positive b squared. Don't forget to combine the like terms, which is ab plus ab is equal to 2ab. And now we have a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. Let's practice. Find the expanded form of x plus 5 raised to the power of 2. Use the product of the sum of the squared binomial, which is a squared plus 2ab plus b squared. Don't forget to get the values of a and b, which is a is equal to x and b is equal to 5. Substitute to the product of the sum of the squared binomial. Now we have x squared plus 2 times x times 5 plus 5 raised to the power of 2. Simplify and now we have the answer x squared plus 10x plus 25. Our next lesson is getting the special product of a difference of a squared binomial. Find the expanded form of the quantity of a minus b raised to the power of 2. First, analyze the value of the given exponent of the binomial. Since it's a squared binomial, therefore, it will do self-multiplication twice. Then, we multiply two binomials using distributive property. Multiply first terms which is a times a is equal to a squared. Multiply the outer terms which we have a times negative b is equal to negative ab. Multiply the inner terms negative b times a is equal to negative ab. Finally, multiply the last terms. Negative b times negative b is equal to positive b squared. Combine like terms. Now we have a squared minus 2ab plus b squared. Let's try this one. Find the expanded form of the quantity of x minus 5 raised to the power of 2. Let's use the special product of the difference of a squared binomial which is a squared minus 2ab plus b squared. Get the values of a and b, which we have a is equal to x and b is equal to 5. Substitute the values to the special product of the difference of a squared binomial. Simplify the given expression. Now we have x squared minus 10x plus 25. 